2017 Audi A4 2.0 T Quattro second drive. Never mind the impending bubble burst, its technology's time and Audi couldn't be happier. The 2017 A4 is the latest attempt to prove beauty and brawn can't beat intelligence outright. And this is the company's best case in 20 years. For two decades, the A4 has been the backbone of Audi's lineup and key in its resurgence in the post-unintended acceleration days. This car has managed to build up a successful following by being an alternative to the more popular BMW 3 Series and Mercedes-Benz C-Class while being nearly as good, if not actually better, than the competition. Audi chose to stake a claim in simple clothes covering technology that was more intuitive than some, being different without being difficult. But Audi is as much a part of the establishment as its big rivals now, so it's not getting any alternative breaks anymore. It's the young tech startup that's finally a grown-up, and learned to dress like one. While Jonathan Ramsey got to drive this new A4 last fall in Italy, Audi sent me to San Diego last week to drive the US spec model that goes on sale in a couple of weeks. And, in short, if you like the old A4, you'll really like this one. The fact this model is known internally at Audi as B9 is a coincidence when you think about its exterior design. The new A4 is certainly attractive, but you'll have to be a huge Audi aficionado to differentiate this over the old car at a glance. And I dare you to find someone who's actually offended by any part of the design. Some creases lower down on the side of the new car help eliminate the bloated look of the outgoing model, without adding too much fuss. Audi still has Acura beat in the precision race. Other new details of note are a wider grille and slimmer headlights, Zenins are standard, full LEDs optional, that make the front of the A4 look lower than before, and new sequential turn signals out back that are just fun to watch in traffic. Changes are far more noticeable inside. The tall, somewhat slab-sided dash of the old car is gone and replaced by something with the more airy feel that we've seen in the TT and Q7. There's less of a black dash to get in the way of the expansive windshield and generous side glass, all unusual in today's automotive landscape. You're going to enjoy the fact you can see out of the A4. This car is also the latest recipient of Audi's virtual cockpit, part of the $3,250 technology package on Premium Plus and standard on top-level prestige models. As in the TT and Q7 that also offer it, the virtual cockpit is a slick presentation of every piece of data a driver could want, vehicle information, changing a radio station, zooming in and out of the sharp Google Earth imaging. Oh yeah, and how fast you're going, too. There's more good news on the tech front, Android Auto and Apple CarPlay are now included, as are two USB ports instead of the old proprietary cable, 